graph the parametric equation and, and determine its direction on the Inspire the easy way. All right. New document. Let's add a calcul. I mean a graph. <clears throat> and then go to menu. Three. Parametric. And let's just type in an equation. Two cosine of t in this case. And t minus cosine of t. Now, 6.28, that's 2 pi already. Uh, but you can actually even type it in like 2 pi like that. It actually understands that pi means pi. So you don't have to actually go all the way to the pi symbol every time you want it. Anyway. Um, so if you enter here, right, look at your graph, right? But that won't help you determine which way it's going or how it's being drawn. So the, there's, you can do it with sliders and all these complicated methods. But the easy way is just to change the parameterization so that you can see it as it grows, right? So you would hit tab, and then you have to go up each time to get to the graph. And instead of going from 0 to 2 pi, just go to like 1. And you'll see it drew that part. And then go to, let's say, 3. And now you see it drew that part. And again, hit tab, and go all the way until you get to 2 pi. And now you kind of have an idea of which direction it's being drawn. That's it.